the right way to build a technology like this is to use all the insights that nature and particular material science has given us about the way that quantum mechanics works in the real world, not on the scribblings of somebody on a pen pad of paper, but really in the lab. How does quantum mechanics work? And then exploit that knowledge in order to build computers that outperform classical computers. Uh, people who say that quantum computing is 20 years away, what they're really saying is they haven't thought an awful lot about it. Uh, the Things don't take certain lengths of time. If you have a concerted, driven, well-managed, well-funded effort to convert basic science into technology, regardless of the field, it's going to take a lot shorter. All artificial intelligence problems at their core require solving optimization problems. So opt optimization sounds like this esoteric thing that you might do if you had to route trucks or figure out the best way to set up a network. But optimization is actually at the core of all the things that make us humans. Now the, the trick is that Optimization is fundamentally hard. It's the type of thing that conventional computers, like we use today, are not good at, especially when these problems get large, like they would if you were trying to solve a human scale reasoning or inference problem. Our systems directly target that bottleneck. The D-Wave 1 and its, uh, its uh, descendants are ideally suited to solving that type of problem and they are going to change the landscape of computing forever.